my name's Caroline Varlin and I run Gap HR Services and also a niche offering for golf clubs called Golf HR. My business offers expert employment law advice to organisations keeping them 100% tribunal free so I make sure that they're doing the right thing with their employees and giving them help if it all goes pear shaped. I started Golf HR two years ago because I already had three golf clubs on my books and I was really enjoying working with them because they're very much a family environment. The problem is when there is a problem, they have to still deal with it under employment law. I'm used to talking to committees and explaining things to them, knowing what other golf clubs have done in similar situations. It's also reassuring for them to know that they actually are not alone with dealing with their staff issues. Right, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I love running seminars, I love being able to talk directly to employers in a relaxed atmosphere where it's fun to give them the information. The seminar I'm running today is How to Fire the Buggers, which is a controversial title. What we're doing is going through the basics of employment law regarding dismissal. We've had a huge amount of fun learning about some of the things you really need to have in place before you get to the point of having to fire people. I think it's hugely important because there's a lot of things that I didn't know and I've got 10 employees so it was really interesting for me, without a doubt. As employers you shouldn't be wasting time deciding on people's sick pay. You should be out there earning money and getting new clients in. What I want is people to be engaged, to use their common sense but also their knowledge of, of the business world to solve the problems and to think what would be the best way going forward. We use lots of different props, chocolates, trophies, golf club mats, everything to make sure people are engaged. It's, it's really brought the whole thing alive for us instead of it being quite a dry presentation. I can't remember the time last time we laughed so much with a, um, a guest speaker. It's been really a lot of fun. I thought this was really good, it's very punchy. Uh, got people thinking, got people interacting. Excellent presentation, really interactive and not just death by PowerPoint. In fact, there was no PowerPoint at all. If you have an oral contract, so nothing written, how much notice does your employee need to give after six years service? One week. One week, absolutely correct. It has been great fun. There's been lots of laughter and amusement, shall we say, on what we do and don't know about employment law and so very entertaining and she's delivered it in a really entertaining way so we've all had a good, good time while learning today. I really want to make sure that everybody's being treated fair and reasonably at work and the best way to start with that is make sure that the employers are confident and knowledgeable about what they're able to do. You can do whatever you want as an employer, just like you can do whatever you want with HMRC. It's just how much it's going to cost you afterwards. It's worth having a phone call with an expert. Most experts are happy to give you sort of five or ten minutes at a time to talk through things so you can tell whether it's as serious as you think it is. I'd recommend people to go to Caroline's seminars and workshops because if you think you know it, you'll suddenly find out you don't.